A local artificial intelligence company in Toronto has created new technology to help businesses like retailers during the pandemic. The company is called Predict Medics. We are really a healthcare artificial intelligence entity. Uh, the two main verticals we operate in are impairment and healthcare. So in the impairment sector, for instance, we have developed technologies, which again, based on face and voice recognition, can identify cannabis or alcohol impairment. And in parallel, we were actually working on technologies for influenza, which we were planning on rolling out when the influenza epidemic or the pandemic was going to hit later during the year. But next thing you know, we were in the midst of a COVID-19 pandemic, and that's where we thought that our technology is actually going to have a lot of utility right now. The goal for this Toronto company is to create a safer environment for public spaces like hospitals, retail stores and arenas. Before entering a facility, an individual would walk into a booth similar to the x-ray machine at the airport and it would scan you for symptoms. So the way how it works is in terms of the hardware, we use multi-spectral cameras. So these are cameras that can screen faces across several different wavelengths. And what we have developed is actually an algorithm where once you input those images or that stream from a multispectral camera, it can pick on a lot of COVID-19 associated symptoms. So things like fever, headache, um, exhaustion, uh, redness in the eye, sweat cell activation. So again, a host of parameters that are associated with COVID-19. And the algorithm processes all that information that it extracts from the video stream and then makes a decision to say if the person is at a high risk of being COVID-19 positive. Uh, we have partnered with JuiceWorks exhibits that are building these modules as we speak, and they are rolling it out across their entire client base. And the demand has been phenomenal. At this time, the technology is still being improved because it can't distinguish between symptoms of COVID-19 and influenza. But as there is more data being fed into the system, and again, leveraging our existing partnerships with hospitals, one of the things that we are doing is we are pushing in a lot of COVID-19 data into the algorithms. So our, what we are anticipating is that within the next few months, we should be able to reach a point where we can perhaps distinguish between COVID-19 and influenza. And for those that may feel this technology is crossing the lines of privacy, Dr. Rahul Kushwa assures you it's not. We do not use any face recognition in terms of identifying the individual. So that's something which is not done at all. So overall, there are no personal identifiers that are used when these uh, algorithms are working. Along with these machines, they have also created social compliance technology, which could determine if you're wearing a mask or social distancing. In Vaughan, Stella Cuisto, City News.